John. Yeah. So, so you, these are your images? Yeah, those are mine. So it's kind of an interesting take, like in terms of like remediation, right? Mm -hmm. Taking like some new media and mapping it onto an old media. Yeah, I mean, it's almost, to me, it's like an objectification of the thing that people, you know, the tools that are used to make photographs, and it's a little bit, for me, like a, um, I don't know, kind of turning those tables on, on the camera, the process of photography, right. and how that fits in, in the history of art. Right. Um, I do this all the time. Like I took a picture with my cell phone of my laptop, and I made that my background. So it's kind of similar in a uh -huh, way. Yeah. It's like okay, we're taking these pictures of objects, but it's on some newer device. Right. It's kind of an interesting take. What was your name again? Sarah. 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 I'm John Phillips. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm faculty here in, in design oh. technology. So, whoa. So. Do you ride a motorcycle? No, you know I'm too clumsy to get to ride to really? actually drive one. I, I ride on it with other people that I trust more than myself. Whoa! <laughs> because I, I know that. I don't no way. I, I'm design technology faculty. Oh, okay. And um, we're shooting a little video here about about these Tuesday events. All right. So you're curious about the artists and what they're doing. I like that. <laughs> That's cool. So, so what we're trying to we're trying to investigate is like how people promote the show. Like, how did you promote yourself as being a part of this show? Did you send that to your friends, or did you just rely on the school to do it? Or that's top secret. Huh? Uh, that's top you have, you secret. Have, you have like your own mailing list, <laughs> like a secret mailing list. The friends. No, no, no. No. You just didn't do it, did you? <laughs> I didn't do shit. You didn't okay, do it. I didn't do shit. <laughs> you just focused on the artwork. Where do your, a lot of your references come from? They come from the <laughs> Walgreens security mirrors. Yeah. Yeah. Chica. Chica or John. We already met. Yeah. I know. Nice I know. Meet you. I'm and Harry. Harry, John. Nice to meet you. So, so what can yeah, what can you do with the mural? Like you can enhance the experience of the mural, but you can't do anything else. Enhance the experience, meaning, like meaning like you can have like one visuals person, or one person in the beginning of this semester put grass down on the right. floor of the gallery and there was nothing else. So in that way like isolated the mural as the only sort of like visual art right. in, the, in the gallery and you could sit on the grass and look at it. So you couldn't put like a wrecking ball through it. No, no. there's no okay. there's no like touching. No touching. That that can, and can you put a, like a sheet in front of it? But what if we had a projector? Could we project onto it? So if I had enough money, how much is this worth? About three million. Three? Three. So if I had three million dollars, I could probably paint over it. No, I think I'm wrong. Thirty-three. Thirty-three? So if I had thirty-three, I could paint over it. Maybe. So really, so it's something that all, all artists in here have to contend with, is what to do with the damn uh, Diego. It seems like some do and some don't. What's what's not allowed? Maybe that should be like what, that should be asked. Like what's not what's allowed? Not allowed in here? Yeah. Just don't touch this. Just don't touch that. So people could do whatever else they want to be, basically. Right. Even though we're within tried. reason. Like you can't probably like probably not destroy the floor nor the walls nor the ceiling. Yeah. yeah. Nor kill any individual.